just a pre-warning the audio for the first minute of this video is a bit off but if you pull through and just watch the first minute after that it's great so apologize in advance but yeah enjoy thanks for watching ah the bakery line extension will it go here here or stay here The Bakerloo Line extension is a proposed extension going southeast from Elephant Castle to Lucian. With the current terminus of the Bakerloo Line being in a Zone 1 area, which is quite unusual for a deep level tube. Although it's been talked about a lot recently, the Bakerloo Line extension is not a new concept, as it was first mentioned back in 1913. Proposals to extend to Camberwell introduced in the 1940s, with the platforms at Elephant Castle even being in the direction of Camberwell in preparation for the extension. The buzz kind of died down into the late 2010s and there was a spike of interest in the extension with there being three proposed routes for the extension with all proposed three routes having stations at Lucian and New Cross Gate. Route 1A being an extension to Lucian via Old Kent Road having two stations at Old Kent Road and one at New Cross Gate. Route 1B being an extension to Lucian via Camberwell and Peckham Rye and option 2 being an extension all the way down to Hayes and Beckenham Junction. It was eventually decided that the most popular route was from Elephant and Castle to Lucian via Old Kent Road. Even though it would be nice having an interchange at Peckham Rye with Thameslink, Southern, South Eastern and London Overground serving there, there is much more potential for redevelopment on the Old Kent Road compared to Peckham Rye and Camberwell not having that much space. Now that the route has been decided, let's see where these proposed stations will be placed. The first station will be here at Tesco Supermarket and it will be called Burgess Park as it is just diagonal to it. The site will be great as it will have loads of bus interchanges just outside the station and it isn't too close to Elephant Castle station. But it may put your beloved supermarket at risk. Now Lidl is the second site of supermarket destruction due to the Bakerloo Line extension. With the second station being the site of the old Toys R Us. With this station being called Old Kent Road, as it is on Old Kent Road. I mean, yes, both of the stations are going to be on Old Kent Road, but one of them has to be called Old Kent Road for reference, am I right? If the station does get built here, this would be great news for the Audi, as the new Lidl supermarket is a mere two minutes away. Now thinking about it, it was quite cheeky for Lidl to build so close to their competitors. I guess after this, Audi will have the last laugh. <laughs> The next station we have is New Cross Gate, which will be located here, which will be on the site of the TK Maxx and the Sainsbury's petrol station, right next door to the Overground and National Rail New Cross Gate station. Yeah, yes. Yes, yes. Supermarkets being at big risk seems to be a common theme for this extension. I definitely feel whoever dropped these plans definitely had some beef with these supermarkets. Finally, we have Lucian Station, where the site is going to be at the current bus station. Meaning they'll have to relocate it. Where? I'm not sure. Lucian's kind of built up right now, so there's not many, many spaces for it to go. The second phase will be an extension to Beckenham Junction and Hayes, taking over the Hayes branch from Southeastern. With it coming up above ground after Lucian to join the Hayes branch at Ladywell. With the idea being to take over the Southeastern services after Ladywell, 
but I think a better idea would be to implement something similar to what the Bakerloo line has in the north of London, where the London Overground services run alongside the Bakerloo line services after Queen's Park. This will however reduce the amount of trains that can run down the Hayes branch, meaning they'll have to end early at Lewisham or Beckenham Junction. Even though it would have a reduced amount of services of the Bakerloo line, I do feel like they should implement this method as the people of the borough of Bromley were complaining that they would lose their direct services to Charing Cross, Waterloo and London Bridge if the Bakerloo line goes straight down to Hayes instead of having a joint service. As yes, the Bakerloo line will serve Waterloo and Charing Cross, but it will take longer to do so. There's also considerations of building a station here at Bricklayer's Arm, which is at the top of Old Kent Road. Sadly, TfL decided not to go through with it, as it was too close to the other stations and it would be too expensive to do so. The route has, however, been safeguarded, so it can get built eventually. So, would the Bakery Line extension actually happen? Realistically, not anytime soon. And if it is going to happen, it will probably end at Lucian and not Hayes. So, this could be the potential end of the Bakery Line. But what do you guys think? Do you think it will end here, Lucian, or do you think it will never be built at all? Anyways, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.